Hello there, Croissant, and welcome. I'm Shadow Lemux, and I'm back on Wreckfest for the Autumn Carnage Tournament to do this week's weekly challenge, which is a demolition attack on the Thunderball. Just going through my settings, just keep uh, gears on manual, ABS, traction control, and stability control on half. Then I don't do anything for the suspension, gear ratio, differential, or big ba brake balance because it's not a race. Top speed is important. You just want to make the car easier to drive. It's about getting points by wrecking your opponents. And the key to this is to keep your multiplier ticking over. It'll go up every time you hit someone or wreck someone. But there are some things that you've got to be careful of. Uh, it's so easy to lose your multiplier. I tend to stay in, in the middle area. Uh, there's loads of little ramps and it's annoying because you want to go over the ramp, you've got this image in your head of going airborne and smashing a car mid-air and it just never happens. What usually happens is that you fly over the top of them or they clip the underneath of your car, you go spinning out and absolutely nothing happens to your multiplier. and just ends up being a big waste of time the, so I stick to the middle but I do reset whenever I get to those points where I basically where you just can't see anyone you know all the cars are on the other side of the map even though it's a small map gotta keep on top of them the moment you lose your multiplier that's it as far as getting a goal time you can consider the challenge over uh, you can lose it maybe right at the beginning, but even then you're relying on a lot of luck coming across cars like this this AI there. Uh, wrecked cars that are basically almost close to being wrecked and you've just got to go finish off the job. But it's, uh, there were so many like hard resets starting again because you just get instances where you'll drive towards a big group of AI and then everything parts. Everyone just, you just drive through the middle, you don't hit anyone and you just watch your multiplier just go from whatever you got it to, to zero and it'll drop so fast. The other point is that you don't want, even though I do reset quite a few times, you don't want to reset too much because it'll always put you back to the point where you started. Now, if all the cars are on the other side of that big mound in the middle of the map, you're just going to lose your multiplier by the time you get to them. So, knowing where all the carnage is taking place is very important. Uh, as I said, when it's all on this side of the map, resetting is a OK, because you know you can easily get to the cars quick enough so you don't lose your multiplier. I get very lucky in this run as well with some wrecking assists which keep my multiplier going when it should have just dropped. And I know the score I set probably will need to be set again to get gold on the PS5, but here it is. So just good luck, Dioch, and thank you for watching.